With summer travel season revving up, cyber experts say you should be aware of the best internet and Wi-Fi safety while out on the road or in the skies. Eric Plam is an internet safety expert and the president of SEMO. He says Wi-Fi in public spaces like restaurants and hotels can be dangerous, especially Wi-Fi that does not require a password. Threats can include malware attacks, phishing attacks, and data breaches. Plam tells me one of the biggest risks are man-in-the-middle attacks. Well, you just assume that that cafe has created a hotspot for their patrons, for their customers, but it's very, very possible that it's some bad actor somewhere else. It could be you know, with a laptop or next door neighbor, and they set up a network with the name that seems to be like it's from that cafe. So you connect to that network thinking that it's safe, but in fact, they're recording your keystrokes and capturing your data. Scary. Plam says there are several things you can do to protect your information, like ask the hotel or cafe for the name of the Wi-Fi network and ask if there is a password. Use a VPN. This increases a secure tunnel for your data to travel through. Keep your antivirus software up to date and use a portable mobile Wi-Fi hotspot. This way you can know you're getting a secure connection. While most airports do require a password for Wi-Fi, Plan says flyers should be aware of a tactic called juice jacking. And that is where you plug your USB cable into some kind of a public USB hub and charge your device. It is also possible for bad actors to connect to your device um, using this, uh, this USB connection. Plam says you can protect yourself from juice jacking by using your own power bank or even an adapter.